Now, this is actually one of my favorite categories, and that is the new artist of the year. So we have Banzi Banero, DSL, King Paluta, Maya Blue, Olive the Boy, and Osei Chrome Sikini. What do you think of this one? Well, I mean, it's a, an interesting mix. And again, yeah. I keep saying this is a category I've gotten correct ever since <laughs> yeah. I started doing predictions. Yeah. Uh, but I feel this year is going to be... It can go left or right. What do you say uh, left or right? Ooh. Because I'm thinking... Uh, for me, there are two clear people okay. that stood out for me, mm. uh, and that would be uh, Kim Paluta yeah. and uh, Olive the Boy. Yeah, boy. We, we got to choose boy. one. <laughs> yes, uh, Olive the Boy had one of the biggest smash hits yeah. from Ghana, and it really toppled over and made it into all the global spaces. Yeah. So it comes off as a very strong song. Uh, Funny enough, I didn't catch the Kim Paluta buzz but, until yeah. this year, yeah. especially when he released the song Asila, mm. and he was doing interviews and all of that. And then uh, I realized that people were really moving towards so him. Yeah. Uh, and his song that he produced the previous year that were also equally hits, I didn't really, it didn't vibe really vibe with me. I didn't hear it actually. Yeah. <laughs> and so, Looking at the last year, and, and then even if I want to look at the current song that I like so much, I said that again, Olive the Boy has a new song, song yes. uh, Asylum, Asylum, Asylum yeah. which yeah. is equally Make buzzing. Yeah. And so, based on that, I would probably pick Olive the Boy. And also, yeah. I think Kim Palita has been around much yeah. longer, he's more mature yeah. and doesn't need that stamp to encourage him as much as if. Perhaps Olive the Boy wins it. It will give him uh, more courage, more sh yeah, yeah, he'll be more confident yeah. and do greater so, things. So your final pick is it Olive, to be Boy. Olive the Boy. So Olive the Boy for new artist of the year.